and welcome to Corporate Roadshow. I'm Dana Peicher and I'm here with Dr. William Lambos and he's here with Wellness Center USA Inc. Thank you for joining us. Thank you, Dana. Let me start by saying a few words about Wellness Center. They are a publicly traded entity on the OTB exchange. They are an umbrella company that through acquisitions acquires companies in the behavioral and medical health area which are alternatives to pharmaceutical approaches to healthcare. So that's what ties the companies together. Some people call that complementary and alternative care, some people call it wellness-based care, but what has it in common is that they're looking for natural, I wouldn't quite go so far as to call it homeopathic, but non-pharmaceutical approaches, all right? We can talk more if you want about why there would be a market or a demand for non-pharmaceutical approaches, but common sense dictates that everybody knows drugs have problems. Right. We wouldn't want to live in a world without them, but the fewer we have to take, the better we are. Right, so this, would you say that what you provide is complementary to what's already existence as Absolutely. in the pharmaceuticals, or in is In some a cases, it's alternative. In right. other cases, it's complementary. So we like the, 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 the term, the sort of complementary and alternative. Right. Now, so what are the specifics of what is done day to day in CNS? Well, let's talk about CNS. Okay. CNS um, Wellness is a uh, Tampa, Florida based neurotherapy clinic. All right. We use non-pharmacological approaches to treat a variety of what we call behavioral health issues, all of which have in common that they are brain based without implying brain damage. All right, there, can, there are many things that we consider dysregulations of the brain. Learning disorders, attention disorders, mood disorders, depression, anxiety, even bipolar disorder. These don't mean you have dead cells in your brain or, or uh, areas of uh, tumors that will show up on MRI or anything. The brain is not regulating itself according to a healthy model. We can read that by measuring the EEG, fancy word is electroencephalogram, uh -huh. from the scalp, all right? And we can do a quantum metric, another big word, we can do an analysis, a mathematical analysis of that, compare those brain waves to a healthy database, and we can say to patient X, you know, your brain waves are a little bit different in this area of the brain than the healthy database, and we're going to help you train your brain using gentle stimulation and feedback until your brain looks more like this healthy pattern. When you do, that OCD that's been driving you crazy, having to go back in the house, check if that door's locked, check if that door's locked, check if that, door, if that door's locked, will go away. Great, so tell me a bit about the training your brain. You know, how does that work well, specifically? Well, the first thing that has to happen is we need to do a thorough assessment in which we map the entire brain and compare it to that neurotypical normative population and find the regions of disparity, the dysregulations. Now we know what needs to get from A to B or C. We then have you, if you are our client or our patient, come in and we do a two-part treatment therapy, one of which is very gentle stimulation using either very low levels, less than a nine volt battery puts out, of stimulation to the scalp, or what we call PEMF, fancy phrase for pulsed electromagnetic frequency. That's what cell phones put out. But this is calibrated to the frequency of the brain waves of the EEG. So it's actually healthy for the brain, and it unsticks those loops that make you say, I need to check that lock, I need to check that lock. Then when your brain is making some healthy EEG in real time, we compare it to that same database and say, guess what? You're getting closer to the healthy. You're going to get a reward. Now, for some people, that's a sound that says, ding. That doesn't work well for children because they get tired of that. They want to make Ms. Pac-Man move around the screen, so we let them do that. Some people, they prefer to have a complex visual feedback, like the plane will fly through the canyon when I make it do that. Right. How they make it do it, they don't know, and we don't know, but we know that you can do it. And since the reward only comes when you're being, when you're generating that healthy brain pattern compared to the normative database in real time, over and over and over, all right, your brain will eventually learn only to make the healthy waves. That's amazing. After a little time, 
Just like riding a bicycle, you're wobbling at first, then you're getting a little better, then you're getting, and after a while, you're not even thinking about right. it. You never forget it. Your brain keeps that change. New synapses, what we call, form, new right. networks form, and the brain regulates itself. So this is beautiful stuff, you know. We can essentially start moving away from heavy medication, and we can actually, like you said, retrain the brain. Does this, the science that you have come up with, does this only exist in your clinic? I think we're speaking a bit about the, the further innovations you want to take this to. Oh. There, some of the therapies we've been using are, as I mentioned, stimulation-based. There's about half a dozen of those. Others are feedback-based, and there's about half a dozen of those. And then there's two of them that are actually hybrid between stimulation and feedback combined. What we've done, and which is proprietary and special to CNS, and which, which is our protected information, is to combine these, these other modalities in very specific ways that we've discovered over the seven years we've been doing this, all right, result in the maximum and most rapid and most permanent change for the better in the fewest number of treatment sessions. The component pieces are out there, but they exist independently. Some of these companies don't even know that other ones exist. The proprietary part is bringing them together in what now exists as heavily protected trade secrets. Not even our therapists know what happens when they push certain buttons, mm -hmm. all right? Only a couple of us at the top know how these protocols are set up, all right? But which are in the process of being patented and submitted for patent protection uh, and, uh, and so forth. So that's what makes this different. The database, for example, that's a commercial database we license. Actually, you might think, well, if it's not under your control, isn't that a bad thing? And the answer is no, it's actually a good thing. You want to know why? Hmm. Because we can't fake the results. Right. If I show you your brain map the day you came to us, and then I feed your EEG after 10 or 20 sessions of treatment, training, and I show you now your healthy brain maps, all right, the only thing I've done is take a black box that I've licensed, which is an FDA registered database developed under National Institutes of Science grants and so forth, you know, admitted in court as passing FRI standards of evidence admissibility. I'm a forensic psychologist too. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> and we take that database, which is a black box to us, and we feed your brainwaves in. If they come out looking more typical, more better, if you'll excuse the term, more normal, right. then we fixed you and we can't fake it. Wow, that's so interesting. All right. So would you say... What keeps us honest. No, I see that. That's amazing. So Wellness Center USA was is basically the... Umbrella company. The marriage of all of these companies. You said there's, you know, technology here, technology there, technology here. This brings it all home. Right. They provide us with the, obviously, capitalization. Right. Exposure. Right. All right. An opportunity, a vehicle for people to invest in us. All right. We envision having clinics all over the country. Um, so they're how we get from here to there without having to build every one, okay, over, you know, out of cash flow, which is a very inefficient model because it's, uh, you know, takes, it would take forever with right. the public funding vehicle, right. all right? And you also mentioned there's another subsidiary called Sarai Shield. That's correct. In Tell fact, me about that. a few months after we were acquired by WCUI, mm -hmm. uh, our chairman, Andrew Candelapas, um, found another company who he felt did what we did in the medical space, which is treatment of, in this case, dermatological conditions, skin conditions, without medications, using this fascinating technology. But you know what? I'm not really qualified to speak about this, but I know someone who is. And in fact, he has one of his um, treatment systems with him and can demo it for you. Oh, wow. Let's so do I'm going to ask. Mr. Scott Johnson, CEO of Soraya Shield, okay. to come up and talk to you about the Soraya Shield system and their product, all of which, of course, are under the umbrella of Wellness Center USA, Inc. Well, I'm very excited to learn about it. Thank you so much for your it's time. It's been a pleasure. Thank and you. Thank you. And if we wanted to hear more information, where can we find that? All right. The best place to go for CNS, mm -hmm. we are in the process of integrating all of our websites under the big umbrella. However, the best place right now is to go to cns-wellness.com.